had a, there was a tail light out. He placed that. It was like forty four dollars mm -hmm. for everything. I take my truck to uh, Elk and Chevrolet where they get an oil change for nine ninety nine for life. So I'm going to get my oil oil change next Saturday and get my tires rotated. I got all new filters. Did you? Yeah. Uh, oil change, tire mm -hmm. rotation, mm -hmm. and uh, he spent a, he spent a couple hours trying to find a why my my trunk wouldn't open. What from, from inside, the, you know that little button you push. Yeah. Your, your trunk comes up. Well, was it short in a wire or something? No. He went all through it, he, and he called, he put the, up on the computer, he put the schematic, you know, and mm -hmm. everything. Yeah. Uh, then he had to call a buddy that, that works for took a Toyota, mm -hmm. and uh, here there's a switch on the inside of the glove compartment. That shuts it off? Or yeah. yeah. Over? It's an over? It's like a circuit that overrides everything or something like that? Right. Okay. In other words, if you wanted to have your car parked by an attendant, right? So you turn that switch off so he can't, he can't so, get into your car, right? So he can't get into the glove compartment. So you must have Or hit. he can't get into the trunk. Okay. So you must have hit it accidentally when you're going through the glove yep. compartment? Yep, I must have. Because mm -hmm. uh, mommy's got one of those uh, handicapped things, you know? Okay. And I, I go in there and I get that quite often. Well, you should get it for yourself. You both need it. You can't walk that far. My mother-in-law has it. She uses it. What time does Bob get off of work? Do you know? Five o'clock. Bob? Five yeah. o'clock. Today. He's going to call a little while. How's he doing? He'll Good? be calling. Yeah, he'll call here for sure. I'll let you talk to him. Yeah. got to ask him something. Bought this hat down the short, too. Did you? Yeah. That's a nice hat. World Series. 2009 World Series hat. Uh-huh. You're like all these uh, Spanish ball players. They don't crown their hats. They're they don't, none of them they, do. Their bills right straight across. They're all flat brim, Dad. The majority of hats they sell now for uh, when you go into a hat store are all flat brim. You gotta, they only have a, a certain amount of bent brim hats. Well, you can, you can form your own. Yeah, the guy on the internet showed me how to do a back brim hat. What did he tell you to do? He told put me in to a coffee cup. Put in a coffee cup overnight, and the, the brim will look really good. And I did it, and I, because I bought a Yankee hat when they won the World Series. And you mean right inside the coffee cup? Yeah, you put the the brim inside the coffee cup. You let it stay there overnight. He didn't say to to wet it or anything. Nope, don't have to wet it. No. I also bought a Hawaii hat too. Bought a what? Hawaii, University of Hawaii. What, like that? A baseball cap? Yeah. Yeah, they have, um, it's got like a big H on it. Yeah? It's like green. You like it? Yeah, it's really cool. Is that where you're going? To Hawaii? I, I like wish. It. I like to go there. Well, you never know. Your, yeah. dad, your dad and I almost had one, one year. Yeah, but Franny Dugan bumped me from my vacation. Huh. We were all gonna. We were all set to go there, stay at a resort, and play golf. But not only that. Did they have a hurricane or something? The reason said? that's right. The reason we didn't go was they had a hurricane there. Did they? Yeah, that's why we didn't go. Oh, I thought it was because of him. No. Oh, all right. I saw Shanahan uh, two weeks ago. <laughs> yeah, he said he saw you. He's asking for you. Oh, he, he stopped by. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I told him. I said you were stopped by to see my dad. Yeah, he does. I'm all the time. Did you talk to Shanahan? Mm-hmm. Talk to him. So you friends with him? No, I wouldn't call him my friend, but I'm, like I talk to him. I'm not going to ignore him. <laughs> Doesn't he owe you like a um, yeah. hundred bucks or something like that? A hundred. More than that. <laughs> you know, like ten thousand dollars. Really? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You ever asked him for it? How come he never <laughs> gave it? He had a, a bunch of fancy orders. He got all out, all out of his debt. Just probably declare bankruptcy or something like that. Those people do. They they know how to do. It. They know every uh, trick in the book because they can afford a fancy tax lawyer to get out of it. 